DLCs. Nether did not have a boss, by the way. Not even Nether Fortress has a boss, so don't even worry about it. Um. Okay, just only when you're ready. There, there's gonna be so much shit going on in this level. You're gonna get stuck at a few parts because of like all the ambushes and whatnot. So, three, two, one, go. I try and roll like it's gonna give me more speed, but it like never does. I just dropped down the hole. Okay. Yeah, and your ears don't really travel too far in this either. Now, I don't know if you if, if I found out, but you have an oxygen bar, and you can kind of replenish that by just walking over certain spots. Yeah, I remember it from the tower. Okay. So now for this, where's the center of the room? Okay, over here. So we have to activate this in the center of the room. And then we have to just kind of pretty much just sit here and wait. I'm not even joking. And then there's two puzzles that need to be done, which is the ones with like the points on the map, which I know how to get to them. So you can just follow me for the most part. Now, while holding, now the user that is holding this actually does get a good bit more speed for some reason, I think. I don't know if it's, I don't know what it has to do with, to be honest with you, but. So I can come over here, I can place this down here, and then it'll open this door. Okay, just go ahead. And then for the most part with this one, I just kind of brute force it. Puffer also just give me speed that lets me just go right through the level. I love Pufferfish, Jesus Christ. Pick this back up, and then for some reason I'm just flying all over the fucking map again. I think what- oh my Jesus Christ. I think when we go to- it's up- it's up the stairs, Void. I think when we go, like, I think when we're done with the puzzles here and we go off from each other, I'm gonna be, like, miles ahead of you and there's there's just nothing you can do about it because I'm gonna have the fucking thing that just sends me flying. There's a way to tell which one's the key if you walk close enough to it and pay attention. That's what I was doing. Awesome. Assuming the conduit like just makes it so you're not in water anymore. Um, it's not really a con though, but it, it's not that it makes you not in water because you still roll like you're in water. It's just it makes you a lot faster for some odd reason. Like your speed is like you're not in water. Okay, you might as well just tell, yeah. You're, well, no, you could get to the ambush. Yeah, it's right here. We literally just play the waiting game here, by the way, Void. There's nothing we can do until the platform starts falling. And then you gotta wait for this one to fall too, which I'm gonna walk around the arena to see if it falls any faster, which, cause sometimes it feels like it does, but. Not really. I bid you farewell. <laughs> oh, I'm already in the next ambush. Oh god, I forgot that the, the, this ambush even existed. I don't know which direction I'm supposed to go though. Okay, I'm definitely, I think I'm definitely going to the right. I'm not sure though. No, I'm going to the left because the, the right is the uh, dead end way. Sometimes it's 
necessary. Oh my god. Get me up. No, 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 no. What? What? Boy, what was that bull right there? Bro, you're ahead of me, how? <laughs> Hold on, if you get up there, I'm gonna just teleport to you. I mean, dead ass right now. Yeah, go I'm ahead. I'm up there. Just keep going. You're gonna hit the boss room. You keep going ahead, but I'll end up getting to you anyways. Yeah, see, this is your. This should. It usually triggers. What the fuck? Okay, I guess I have to teleport to you again. You wanna know what it did? It, it got me stuck in the, the falling platform. But because I teleported you, we're both here now, so no biggie. Now, this is interesting because you literally can't kill this guy. Well, you can, but it makes you go through phases of him, so it's like you can't at the same time. So we're in an auto scroller now. This one takes about like five to six minutes for me to do solo, which is about as long as it's gonna take us right now, so. He's gonna come back into the arena and then it's gonna be like a two shot pretty much. Let's see. Let me through! Faster than you void. What the fuck? <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Let me compare that to the solo, because that was actually not too bad. I think the solo is like a 530, but... I don't know. There's a, there's a good bit of my DLC times that are pretty bad solo, even. Like, I could probably shave like three minutes off of my, uh... Yeah, I was 20 seconds behind my solo. Oh, we beat... We, I think we technically beat Mephus time, though. Like, Mephus solo. Okay. So that was Abyssal Monument. Radiant Ravine, on the other hand, there's one ambush at the beginning of the level, 